One challenge our mission partners face is machine learning in forward deployed autonomous settings. For example, a network of drones observing the world through imaging may wish to create a joint model to classify those images. If one or more drones is captured by an adversary, we must ensure that nothing is revealed about the models. The Cicada project is a collaboration between Sandia Labs and the University of New Mexico to develop the necessary foundations for privacy preserving machine learning in large networks of autonomous drones or players. There's published work addressing the case of two or three players, but we may need to support dozens. Our approach to privacy preserving machine learning involves a technique called secure multi-party computation or MPC. This technique requires players to construct and distribute shares of any information that they need to keep secret. In our case, that will be the machine learning model that the players are jointly constructing. In the drone footage you see, the secret machine learning model is never contained in any one location. Rather, it is distributed through all four of the drones. An adversary would have to collect all of the drones or decrypt all of the pairwise communications in order to learn the secret. Our current capability is limited to linear regression, which is one of the simplest machine learning models. After a drone's camera captures an image, we encode that as a small array of numbers, which we interpret as a point in space. Given a set of tens of thousands of training images, such as pictures of the digits zero through nine, the model is a set of parameters that describes a linear relationship in the data. When we see a new point, that linear relationship gives us a prediction. The drones you see are snapping pictures of digits and using a previously learned model to classify them. One of our biggest challenges was performing this computation in a low power environment where hardware could fail. If one of the players does fail, our software has to detect that failure, determine which players are still functioning, and redistribute the missing player's information in a privacy-preserving way so the computation can continue. Uh, the best thing is we've made all of our work available as open source up on GitHub, where anyone can take a look and use it in their own projects. The demonstration we did had only four drones flying, but we envision much larger networks of players. To prepare for larger networks, we have developed strategies to form groups of the players. Using combinatorial arguments, we can show that we can tolerate a substantial number of failures while being able to resist coalitions of honest but curious players who may try to learn more than their share. We depart from the current norm in privacy-preserving machine learning. Current state-of-the-art systems are based on an algebraic object called a ring for convenience. This technique would run into trouble in our mission context. Our secure mathematics are based on an algebraic object called a field, which will allow us to handle many more parties in the network. In the future, we will need to use more sophisticated machine learning models. Our current approach uses some tricks to reduce communications while still preserving privacy. More research is needed in order to extend such tricks to the deep learning methods that have had so much significant impact on speech recognition and image classification. To underscore that point, we note that the demonstration we did was only a first step. Here, a drone is taking a picture of a digit for classification. If it simply rolled a 10-sided die, its classifications would have 10% accuracy. Linear regression methods that process our images can have 70% or more accuracy. Our actual accuracy was only 55% due to some issues with the webcams we were using. Sandia's Autonomy New Mexico Drone Lab was stood up to help mature early stage technologies such as Cicada to a physical flight demonstration. In this case, each drone is running two Raspberry Pi computers. The first consumes data from the motion capture system and uses that to autonomously control the vehicles. The second is running the Cicada software. This graphic shows our method for positioning the drones in space using cameras arranged in a large rectangle around the room. The lines indicate which camera can see which drone, and we use this information to choreograph a dance used to implement the Cicada demo. Sandia researchers collaborate with dozens of universities, but we have a special relationship with the University of New Mexico right here in Albuquerque. John Barry and I have collaborated with Professor Jared Saya of UNM for many years on various topics, most recently this Cicada project. It's been very productive. Our weekly research meetings with Jared are always a highlight of the week. Going forward, we're interested in extending our tools on privacy preservation 
to nonlinear machine learning techniques, such as logistic regression and deep learning. The Cicada project has been a three-year effort as part of Sandia's laboratory-directed research and development program. That program enables us to research ideas that may have impact on Sandia and U.S. government mission far into the future.